So guys, and if ever like you are troubleshooting and you are or trading on Derev Broker, let me just log into my Derev Broker account. Just log into your Derev Broker account. And if ever, you know, uh, you've logged in successfully, you should be able to see your trade. But if ever uh, you haven't logged in successfully, just go to under general. It will tell you what have happened into your account. Just like, yeah, automated the trading is disabled the account has been changed blah 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 and it also gives you a notification if ever like you know you've managed to log into your account just like yeah it gives you the status of your account what's happening with your account so with that being said if ever the problem is not really with the system it's about logging in or everything uh there's also another thing that i also want to show you about you know, uh, if ever like you want to stop uh, the system from prohibiting uh, automated trading each and every time you, you, you change an account, go to tools, go to options and under options, go to expect advices and allow trading disable, disable automated, disable algorithm trading when the account has been changed and tick that disable algorithm trading when the profile has been changed. Disable that and just ignore the rest and allow DLL imports potential danger able only for trusted applications and you already trust Menofar, so that's not a problem. And on the rev, guys, I just want to make a point here on the rev. According to the guide, uh, the guide will show you a minimum lot size per each and every market instrument that you can use on the rev. Like the more we're still gonna add and improve on these ones, like for boom. 500 index you can use the minimum lot size of 0.20 you can't use 0.01 or 0.1 or 0.19 it will say under experts again you will come under expert it will tell you that an invalid volume will give you any type of errors that it will give you so make sure that you follow the minimum lot sizes that are required for a trace to happen on these synthetic markets over here all of these they have a minimum load size you can plug the system with so without wasting any of your time i already attached many of all but i also like to show you on how the synthetic system works on the rev as well i think won't take time with setting it up just like you know it's as a b c d so it doesn't even take time i'm just gonna go ahead and create um the synthetic yeah there it is and once again it's already under downloads and there is the synthetic system and make sure the program is mql5 program because i know there are a lot of people who are taking chances there and make sure the pictures as well you already download them your forex villa pro logo they are also there so just copy the the system file and just come paste it under the folder that you just created and again there it is and you just go to mkl and go to your images and under images, you know, we need those two images, your RVP logo and your TSS both image. Just copy, copy them, copy them both. And just say copy and go back to those images and paste it there. And just close it over there and come back to your terminal and just refresh. And just like that, you have the synthetic system plugged in so this is a new version guys and again it comes with the input settings for some of these markets over here and my bad i should have included a minimum lot size minimum trade size but it's on the guide guys you can check it out like for instance if i want to trade vix 75 i have to use the proper settings for vix exercises use trail uh, 100,000 step 100 and trail above is 200,000. So under imports, the things that I have to change is the turn points 100,000 
and thrilling steps 100 and thriller post 200,000 and then here my trade size remember there's a minimum here it says for VIX it doesn't show here but here on the guide for VIX 75 just there is 0 0.010 0 0.0010 so I must use that perfect lot size there 0 0.0010 whatever it is we'll always bring it back there and the number of buy position i keep it at five the number of sell position i also keep it at five and just make sure live trading is also ticked over here and just like that there's a thick system it also has a clear all button this time guys we've improved we've done incredible we've went behind and just decided you know what let's give it a little bit of an upgrade and there it is and again guys if you want to trade things like crash uh, also the function under one minute time frame and you just attach your system like that and make sure live trading is on and as well as that it's on and just check it says crash or boom 1000 index is 10,000 for trailing points 1000 for trailing step and 30,000 for trail above so let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Your trailing point is 10,000. And then here is 1,000. Here is 80,000. And again, again, your trade size, you should check that with the guide. Uh, it's 0 0.2. I, I, I think, yeah, there it is. 0 0.2, 0 0.2. So here you should say 0 0.2. So it, don't be scared by this huge trade size because like it's equivalent to 0 0.01 on a currency pair. So bear with me. And then here the maximum long trades, maximum short trades. You can change that. This is for buy. This is for sell. The number of positions you want the system to take, and just tick OK. And just like that, the system will definitely trade for you. 24 7 if you want but as you always know me i prefer volatility over everything but this is the riff you don't need that go ahead kill it and yes the synthetic system can work on currencies you can always refer to the same input settings right here but to guarantee you be careful tread carefully we've already we just only tested it on euro usd uh great britain usd those major currencies only so guys without wasting any of your time i don't think there's any more things that i can add and um uh, troubleshooting for you to be able to like run the system effectively without any hassles this is it if ever you run into trouble screenshot and for an instant let's say you go through some couple of losses remember because this is system this system is only 90 percent accurate so you gonna go into some losses here and there and those losses they only account for the 10 percent so don't stop running just run because overall result we already know that's gonna be profit and if you're running into losses that you want us to have a look at screenshot or just simply go to your history and just right click and just say report and you can open your report whether in uh, Excel spreadsheet or use Internet Explorer and just send us that so we can have a look. Because we know uh, the opening of a trade and the closing of a trade, you can also detect using PIP. You understand? So we're very, we're very good with detecting that. So guys, without wasting any of your time, let us know, send trading history whenever you go through some losses. And let us help you. We're going to tell you if the losses is caused to some errors or you've lost connection to the server. And yes, make sure you have strong internet connection, guys. It's your boy, Peter. Uh, don't forget to sign, to subscribe, like, hit that notification bell. And let us know how you think, man. Let's engage under the comment section there. Your boy, Peter, signing out. Forex Villa Pro, guys.